What up, what up, what up? What is going on, guys? You boys, just welcome back to another NBA 2K14 My Career Gameplay. First off, let's see what GS got to say. All right, y'all. I'm taking over tonight. Everybody better sit back and get ready to watch the show, man, because it's going down, baby. Come on. As you can see, my main man, Golden GS, is ready to contribute to this game so uh here we go going up against the pacers man one of the tougher teams in the league right here man we try to hit him a little razzle dazzle a little step back and i was feeling it i don't know i had just watched he got game figuring i was jesus shuttleworth man i was just gonna go on ahead throw it up i was gonna go ahead and splash a three in front of people's faces and then all the all the girls in the crowd like oh my god i can't believe we made that he's so nasty we need to have his babies right there we go up and we end up making the easy bucket. Uh, unfortunately, this right here, uh, I made a mistake last commentary. There was actually two games where I thought I had. Uh, oh, look, look at the steal, though. Look at the steal, though. We go up for the left hand uh, windmill. Um, there was actually two games where I had bought the posterizer, but it wasn't uh, equipped. Why? I don't know. It just, it just wasn't. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know why. I bought it and it didn't, it didn't show up can't i don't know <laughs> but uh you see we jump out to an early start the pacers man they they shoot a lot of jump shots a ton and uh it led to a lot of uh fast break opportunities right here man speaking of fast break opportunities i try to get one going but i kind of get tripped up right there send a pick i'm sending a pick oh i'm open i'm open show them the range though you can't leave me that wide open young blood we jump out to an early 13 to 3 lead we fast forward a little bit now it's uh, 19 to 7 one thing that's very frustrating about going up against these Pacers is David West the guy doesn't miss anything I swear he was doing every shot imaginable like he was damn near a globetrotter like he would just out of the bounce the ball off his damn head like he's a seal and it would go in like he, he couldn't miss and it was frustrating right now we're up 25 to 12 and um right now at this point it's 27 to 18 and then i call for the ball it's not that i call for the ball but you know i'm hitting a so i hate that they do this this right here it's like every bucket they do like a small miniature one second cut scene where they show the player running down the court and i'm pressing a to like skip that i don't even know if pressing a helps but i always just try and press a and skip it because i like right here after the bucket they do that every score every basket is that something you can remove i don't know it's frustrating Every score, and like I'm, I'm trying to press A, I'm trying to hurry up, and then um, because I'm pressing A, when it got back to normal view, I'll you know press A, called for the ball, and it got stolen. Right here, man, as you see, eight minutes remaining, and we end up uh, getting to the bench, and we missed the rest of the second half, man, which was definitely frustrating. Why am I sitting so much? Um, I did have some foul trouble this game, and. Uh, uh, again, because I, I always continuously spam A to try and get past all these miniature cutscenes, that uh, Demarcus Cousins was in foul trouble and he got a foul, and had it had I guess it had asked me if I wanted to take, you know, responsibility for the foul. So um, I press A. I mean, I would have done it anyways, you know, but I press A and I get a foul that I didn't even need to have, and uh, I've been in foul trouble, you know, the entire game, which is. You know, frustrating. You know, as a Puerto Rican, we need to be able to attempt to steal. It's just in our blood, man. It's just in our blood. Right there, we go around the edge, and we end up going for the dunk. Yo, that posterizer, next game, uh, next game, you guys will see the uh, the posterizer effect. And it is nasty. It, oh, oh man. I don't I don't know what game uh, it is, but in one of these games coming up very soon, I go off. I mean off. Career high. I think in one game I had like 12 dunks or something like that, man. It went crazy. After that game, I had to up the difficulty because, um, you know, I was an all-star. And I went nuts with posterizer and finisher. I went nuts. All right, now's the time to up the difficulty. So I do have uh, superstar gameplay coming up. Uh, if not tomorrow, the day after. I'm not sure because, like I said, one day, man, I... I went ahead and I played, actually it was today, I played like six games in a row. So, I don't know when, but within the next couple games, I'm going to go on ahead and get some um, some superstar gameplay up the level. Like I said, one game I just went nuts. I, I wasn't missing anything. I was just going through the lane, 
and just dunking over everybody, including the greatest dunk I've ever performed in a 2K game. And I've dunked thousands of times, not just this season. I'm talking about for my 2K career, all the way back to like 2K like two with Allen Iverson on the Dreamcast. Like I just um, had a dunk that was just incredible, and that and that'll be coming up soon. It's not this game, but you know, like I was saying, man, uh, had a had a good game this game. And uh, one thing that, that sucks is they always do it. Always, always, always. It's the frustrating thing in the world. Is that I get that damn challenge. Oh, you think you're a superstar. Scored 10 points in a row. And it sucks because I can't create my own shot. I need to be able to pass. And I'm just spamming shots to try and get this done. And uh, I, I keep you know I keep missing. And that's what you're going to see in the, uh, the fourth quarter. Is that they end up going on a huge run. Not because we sucked at offense. It's because I was the offense just spamming shots trying to get this challenge done. I sw that, that is by far the most frustrating challenge in this game. I'm sure it might be easy for somebody who's good at the game, know what they're doing, and, and can probably score with no problem. But for me, five baskets consecutively without having to pass, it, it, it's too much, man. I, I've only succeeded. I've only been successful, I should say, with it only one time. Right, you see, man, it's a three-point lead. I played the entire fourth quarter. Well, three-point deficit at this point. And uh, this is where they hit me with it. This is where they hit me with that stupid-ass challenge. And it just goes downhill. You know, I, I just try to, you know, shoot as much as possible right here, man. We go up for the quick jam as uh, they end up making a bucket. And we went down court for the quick jam. So, 90-70, uh, to 70, as you see, they're starting to pull away a little bit. Why? Because I'm shooting, I'm shooting, I'm trying to score 10 points in a row, I'm missing, and they're not. And it, it's, it's, it's frustrating. Frustrating. I don't even think we've won as a, as, as a starter yet. We've lost to the Cavaliers, right? Wasn't that the last game? I don't, I don't even know. See, I'm going to have to check as I'm doing this commentary. See, my memory is not all that great. And I just posted the video a couple hours ago, so I, I should know this, man. All right, we're trying to show them the strength. Look at my field goal from 55 all the way down to 38. I believe it went up to 40 after that quick little bucket. But um, I, like I was saying, man, that challenge is so stupid. And they always continuously do it to me for no reason. They they, they try to punish me. They want me to lose. That's what it is, man. They want me to lose. So uh, 100 to 80. And the game actually comes to an end because I actually get fouled out, man. Yes, I get fouled out. Very, very frustrating, man. So we're going to jump into a couple of cut scenes. Um, the voices are a little off course, so I apologize for that. That happens every now and then. I don't know why, but uh, I get fouled out, man. We fast forward the game, and uh, now we're going to go on ahead and jump into the cut scenes. Like I said, man, uh, <laughs> the words don't, the words that are coming out of my mouth don't match up. It's a little delayed, but we jump into a cut scene where DeMarcus Cousin threatens me to give him the ball at all times, and... And you know what I thought? I look right in his face. And I said, you know, I ain't no, I ain't no punk. I ain't going to let you punk me like that. Okay, anytime you want. Okay, when you're in the post, I got you. Yeah, sure. What's going on? Thanks. I'm just trying to do everything I can to show Coach and you guys that I deserve the spot. Yo, I cannot argue with that. If we can get anywhere close to the level of success those guys had, woo, that'd be amazing. Yeah, for sure. Hey, I'm down to do whatever it takes. All right. Hey, I'll do my best. Like I said, I'm just trying to win some games. I'm down with that. 
All right, man. Later. Thanks for stopping by. As you know, it's important for me to regularly check in with all of our players. So, how are you feeling about the team at this point of the season? Hey, I'm really happy with the team right now. I like the direction things are going. Coach has been great. Hey, we just got to keep winning games, you know? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Listen, I'm really happy that things are working out for you. Keep up the good work. For sure. Definitely. Thanks for checking in. No, anytime. Absolutely. See, I heard you got a new place. How's it coming along? Oh, man. It's you like looking it? good up in there. Yeah? Got to well, come through. I'll have a barbecue one of these weeks. Oh, I'd love to, yeah. I'd love to check it out. I heard the views are really nice. Oh, man. You know, always. Bring the lady, of Okay. Course. Yeah. The Couple secretary, maybe. maybe. <laughs> yeah. That all works. Play some 2K. Oh, have you heard about the new... 